Hi, year three, and we have a brilliant lesson today. So our learning objective is to be inventive with our writing. And I have got with you a really lovely book to share with you. It's called Until I Met Dudley. And we are going to create our own year three version of this book. Um, so first things first, I'm going to read the story to you. Um, when I've read it to you, you'll understand a little bit more, I hope, about what we are going to do as a class about um, making our own version. As you can see, it says, until I met Dudley, how everyday things really work. So sit back, enjoy a little story. I thought I knew how a toaster worked. When you put the slices of bread into the toaster and push the handle down, an alarm goes off underground telling the toast elves to spring into action a friendly dragon toasts the bread with his fiery breath, but sometimes he breathes too hard. Cogwheels and conveyor belts, treadmills and telescopes, it's all so simple. Until I met Dudley. And there we go. We have a lovely picture of this is how she thought a toaster worked. And the next page tells us the actual science behind how a toaster actually works. So here's Dudley and he explains, actually a toast you need electricity, you plug it in. Um, if you want two, two, two pieces of toast, you put two pieces in, it uses springs, etc, etc. Now this part of the book, we're not going to do the science side this time. We might do it at another time um, potentially, but I'm really um, interested in your creativity. So thought I knew how a dishwasher worked. You load the dishwasher, put in the detergent and turn it on. The switch is linked to a special siren that makes a high pitched whistle that can be heard only by cats. At the signal, all the cats in the neighbourhood come running to your house and, a, and they climb into the machine through a special cat flap at the back. That's the banging you hear. Then all the cats lick the plates, cups, pans and utensils clean, singing happily to themselves. That's the humming you hear. When everything is nice and clean, they leave. And the last one out sprinkles the detergent around the machine to get rid of any cat smells. Until I met Dudley. There you go. That's how the little girl thought a dishwasher worked. Can you imagine that? Cats actually licking all your things in. But it's very funny, isn't it? And then Dudley X goes on to explain the science behind actually how a dishwasher works. So we might scan these pages in or get some ideas from the internet. But I thought I knew how a refrigerator worked. Special polar bears arrive every night to deliver blocks of ice cut from icebergs floating in the oceans of the Arctic. They pack the refrigerator with the ice and make sure everything is cold enough before leaving. As the ice begins to melt, water runs down the back of the fridge into a secret compartment at the bottom. Here, it flows into a water wheel which drives a fan that spins cool air to keep the fridge cold. Until I met Dudley. So can you see we've got polar bears coming, bringing the ice. It all runs down here into this Oh, I'm on the wrong side. Into this special water wheel down here that spins a fan and makes everything cold. And then Dudley explains the actual science behind refrigerators and actually how they heat food cold. It's not polar bears at all. I think polar bears are much more exciting. I thought I knew how a vacuum cleaner worked. Dust is the favourite food of the vacuum snake. He sleeps curled up inside the tube until the vacuum cleaner is switched on. He has a huge appetite and is a noisy eater, gobbling up all the dust, crumbs and buttons as he can find. When a vacuum snake is full, he waits until midnight, then slithers outside and sneezes. The trouble is, he always leaves the door wide open so that the wind blows the dust back in. Until I met Dudley. <laughs> and then Dudley explains the science behind a vacuum cleaner and how it actually works. I thought I knew how a garbage truck worked. 
Pigs are kept inside the truck. The garbage is emptied into the troughs at the back where the pigs stuff themselves. They're the happiest pigs in the world. Until I met Dudley. And of course, Dudley shows her how the garbage truck actually works and explains it's not pigs at all. I used to imagine all sorts of crazy things I knew. I thought I knew how an aeroplane flies, how a clock ticks, how bagpipes get their honking, how large ships keep afloat, how stars shine at night, how bubbles get into fizzy drinks, until I met Dudley. So, today, what we're going to do is create our own versions of the little girl's version. So I want you to think up of as the most creative, inventive things that you can. And it can be things that, that she has come up with herself. It doesn't have to be brand new things. Um, you could do um, completely new ideas. I've put a list on Shobi of things that you could do. It could be a mobile phone. It could be a toilet. It could be a barbecue. It could be a hose pipe. It could be a sprinkler system. It could be a Nintendo Switch. It could be a TV. It could be anything at all. Um, but I want it to be creative and inventive, not the normal. It can't just be how it actually works. I don't want you to say, I'll, I turn my television on and we press it on because the electricity comes from the plug and pictures come on the TV. I want it to be wild and exciting. If you want to have little tiny mice running in wheels and putting little pictures up and acting, you know, you have got free reign to do whatever you want. The only thing is, it has to start. We have to take the same format as this book. So you must, on your pages, I'd like you all to have, I thought I knew how A, and then you put in whatever it is here. So if you were doing, I thought I knew how a Nintendo Switch worked, and then you draw how you think Nintendo Switch actually works, as in, um, I don't know, little elves with pointy hats and Mario actually doing it, or whatever it might be, with um, a little piece of text explaining what it is here. Everything going on, la da 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 da. Great picture, loads of detail. You know, they haven't just done one little thing. We need lots of detail. And then the final thing at the bottom for every single one we do needs to say, until I met Dudley. Okay. And then I'm expecting everybody to do at least two. Some of you might do three, but at least two each. Um, and we'll put them all together and we'll end up having our own version of Until I Met Dudley. Okay, so have some fun with it. I'm really looking to see, looking forward to seeing them. I can't wait uh, to see how creative you can be. Enjoy it.